Hi guys, I hope you are all doing well. Let's see today's question. So today's question, we are taking this up from the topic of permutations and combinations. And if I talk about the question which is given to us here, the question tells us if NCR denotes the number of combination of N things taken R at a time. So we know NCR is the combination here where N is the total number of options you have. R is the required number of options to be selected. Then the expression which is given to us, it's asking us NCR plus 1 plus NCR minus 1 plus 2 times NCR that is equal to what? And if I talk about the answer choices that are given to us here, it is N plus 1, CR plus 1. The second option given to us here is N plus 2, CR. Third option, it's telling us N plus 2, CR plus 1. And the fourth option that is given to us here is N plus 1, CR. So we need to figure out which one of the answer choice is the correct answer for this entire expression given to us. Before starting with the entire idea, if I first write down the formula that we have here, NCR, it's given to us as N factorial over R factorial into N minus R factorial. So that is the entire idea for the combinations that we're going to use. Now let's start with the left hand side of the entire expression. So I get NCR plus 1 plus NCR minus 1 plus 2 times NCR. So what I can do here is when I have 2 times NCR, I can split it as NCR plus NCR. So if I split it as NCR plus NCR, I will take NCR plus 1 with NCR. So NCR plus 1 plus NCR. I will take that together. And for the other bracket, I will keep the left out remaining. So NCR and NCR minus 1. So I have this entire thing. Now we have a conclusion here for NCR plus NCR minus 1. Let's figure out that conclusion first. So if I try to derive it, NCR is N factorial over R factorial into N minus R factorial. And if I talk about this, it is N factorial over R minus 1 factorial into N minus R minus 1 factorial. So you have N factorial common. You have 1 over R factorial into N minus R factorial plus 1 over this is r minus 1 factorial and this is n minus r and minus into minus is plus. So n minus r plus 1 factorial. So you get n factorial 1 over r into r minus 1 factorial and this we will keep it as it is on n minus r factorial plus 1 over this becomes r minus 1 factorial. And the other bracket, if I see n minus r plus 1 and n minus r factorial then. So we know how we can write this as basically is 5 factorial. If I have, I can write it as 5 into 4 factorial. So that is the same idea we are using here as well as here. Now, if I take out n factorial common, you have 1 over r minus 1 factorial into n minus r factorial that is also common from this entire bracket so i get r minus 1 factorial and n minus 1 factorial repeating so i take it common you are left with 1 over r plus you are here you are left with 1 over n minus r plus 1 so you get this n factorial over r minus 1 factorial into n minus r factorial. And this, if I see, it becomes n minus r plus 1 plus r over r into n minus r plus 1. So you get this entire thing. Now let's see what I get here. So n factorial. This basically, if I try to solve it, R and R gets cancelled. So you have N plus 1 also multiplied with N factorial. And the other denominator, if I see R into 
r minus 1 so it becomes r factorial again and this if i see i can write that as n plus 1 minus r into n minus r factorial so you have this entire thing here now if i try to further solve it you have n plus 1 into n factorial that makes it n plus 1 factorial next you have r factorial and if you see here you have n plus 1 minus r into n minus r factorial so that basically i can write that as n plus 1 minus r whole factorial so you have if you see now you have n factorial r factorial and n minus r factorial that is nothing but expansion of ncr so simultaneously if i compare it this entire thing with this I can write this as n plus 1 instead of n and r as r. So I can write that as n plus 1 cr. So I get the understanding that I can now use the rule n cr plus n cr minus 1. It is equal to n plus 1 cr. So whenever the power here is same and the denominator is just reduced by 1 which is in the base, you get the answer as r in the base and your power gets added with 1. So you get n plus one. So if I use that idea of the question now, so I have written it like this now. So if I use this idea, we know ncr plus ncr minus one is equal to n plus one cr. And so I got this and I try to write this now, ncr plus one plus ncr it's equal to, again, instead of n, I'll write it as n plus one. And this, if you see, it is reduced. So you can write that as r plus 1. So you can write this entire expression as n plus 1 c r plus 1. And here you can write that as n plus 1 c r. Now, once again, you have that power same. So you write that. And if the, you see the base, it is again reduced by 1. So again, if you write, try to write it n plus 1 c r plus 1 plus n plus 1 cr so you would write this r plus 1 the first same as it is and you increase your power with 1 so you get n plus 2 so you get the answer here n plus 2 c r plus 1 so that is the final answer but let's check if it matches with the answer choice that we have here so n plus 2 in the power so it cannot be the answer it also cannot be the answer and in the base, we have R plus 1. So in the base, we have R plus 1. So C becomes the correct answer for the question given to us. I hope you have understood how to solve this type of questions, which deals with the ideas of combinations here by applying the formula. So we just had to use one rule here for the entire question. And that was NCR plus NCR minus 1. It is equal to N plus 1 CR. So which is equal to n plus 1 cr. So if you use that, you get the answer to the question which was asked to us. And that matches with option C. So C becomes the correct answer for the question given to us. I hope you have understood how to solve this type of questions. I'll see you again tomorrow with some other question from some other topic. And we are going to continue our questions on JWE mains. So stay tuned for more videos to roll out. And if you are enjoying these videos that we are doing every day, Please do like the videos on my channel and support the channel as well. Also, subscribe to my channel. Do share these videos with your friends also who are involved in the preparation of questions on JWE. So they can also take the benefit from these questions which we are solving on everyday basis. I'll see you tomorrow with another video. Thank you.